हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल आईटी प्लैनेट इफ दिस वीडियो इज हेल्पफुल टू यू देन डोंट फॉरगेट टू हिट लाइक बटन एंड सब्सक्राइब द चैनल आईटी प्लैनेट हियर इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी द एक्सरसाइज सॉल्यूशन ऑफ क्लास 6 चैप्टर नंबर 3 एक्सेल क्रिएटिंग वर्कशीट सो फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज टेक द करेक्ट आंसर in that first question is the collection of rows and columns is called worksheet the correct answer is worksheet you can also select a cell in a worksheet using the arrow keys the answer is arrow the number of columns in a single worksheet is 16384 you can make a worksheet look more attractive and legible by formatting number 5 alignment means the way in which data is settled within the boundary of a cell the answer is alignment and number 6 is the conditional formatting is used to format the data according to specified condition the answer is condition so all green color words are the answers of the correct answer question let's see second question b question right true or false so first statement is cells may contain four types of data so this is false statement there are different types of data you cannot save worksheet data as a pdf and html file false this is false statement we can save worksheet as pdf or html file number 3 you cannot cancel the last change that you made to the worksheet false you can change by using undo feature right so number 4 statement you can change the font of numbers in excel yes this is true statement you can change the font excel automatically left aligns the text in a cell and right aligns the number this is true statement and border separates the data from surrounding cells this is also a true statement let's see question number c that is fill in the blanks there are 1048576 rows and 16384 columns in a single worksheet a letter identifies each column and a number identifies each row and by using undo feature by using undo feature one can revert the last changes merge and center command is used to quickly create a merge cell to hold the title text and the number 5 border can be added to the cells for separating the data from surrounding cells so these are the answers of fill in the blanks let's see differentiate between the following firstly we have to write the difference between workbook and worksheet so let's see what is worksheet sorry firstly workbook workbook a spreadsheet file is called workbook which is like a notebook having many individual worksheets and worksheet Excel allows us to organize data in rows and columns. These rows and columns are collectively called worksheet. Next is moving data and copying data. So moving data it allows us to reorganize data in our worksheet. When we move data, the data disappears from its original location. and the copying data means it allows us to copy data in our worksheet without retyping when we copy data the data remains in its original location and at the same time appears appear in the new location so this is the difference between workbook worksheet and moving data and copying data let's see the next question answer in one to two sentences first question is, is what is the use of microsoft excel so microsoft excel is used for manipulating numbers organize data 
here comma should be here numbers organize data store data as workbook and share the data with others question number 2 what is the default row height and column width in excel the default column width of excel is 8.43 measured in characters and the default row height is 15.00 measured in points question number 3 why do we need to select cells in excel we and answer will be we need to select cells in excel to perform tasks like editing calculating and formatting and question number 4 that is what is the need of formatting in excel formatting displays the worksheet in an attractive and more legible outlook we can make our worksheets more presentable by applying one or several of excel formatting features and in that question number 5 is what is the use of border so borders are used in worksheet worksheet cells to separate the data from surrounding cells so friends don't forget to subscribe the channel here on this channel you will get the exercise solutions of your all the chapters of your computer book so don't forget to subscribe the channel next question number f that is answer briefly in that first one question is what are the features of excel there are various features of excel such as number 1 editing and formatting data b using formulas and functions c printing worksheets and d creating charts and objects so these are the various features of excel question number 2 what is the use of alignment name the different alignment buttons and the answer is alignment means the way in which the data is sectored within the boundary of a cell the different alignment buttons are which are different alignment buttons align left center align right top align middle align and bottom align by default excel automatically aligns text data to the left and number data to the right and the next third number question what is the use of conditional formatting write the steps to remove conditional formatting so conditional formatting feature of excel allows us to apply certain formatting options such as background color borders or font formatting to data that meets certain conditions and which are the steps to remove conditional formatting click on home first step then secondly click on conditional formatting click on clear rules and then clear rules from selected cells so in this way you will you, will, you can remove the conditional formatting and the last question application based question your teacher ask you to create a table of student in excel who are good at various sport activities in the school while making the table you have forgotten to add an important row in the table now you want to insert the row without disturbing the whole table by which option will you do so and the answer is to add new row in the table without disturbing the whole table we can use insert sheet rows option so friends this is the exercise solution of class 6 chapter number 3 and once again i am requesting you to subscribe the channel and thank you for watching this video take care bye bye